Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever in the world you are listening from. We are doing a sponsored review on a company, ICO, called Clintex, C-L-I-N-T-E-X. Website, clintex.io, C-L-I-N-T-E-X dot I-O. The professionalism of this project is off the chain. I'm really impressed with what these guys are doing. Very, very professional, unlike probably anything I have evaluated in quite some time. Call letters CLX. Hard cap, $17 million US, $17 million. Total coin supply, $366 million, of which 50% of the coins uh, will initially be sold and the cost of the token is 10 cents USD. Payments accepted, Ethereum, Bitcoin, and here's a new one. This is the first one I've done that is actually took BNB and it's Binance coin. Pretty, pretty cool. Ethereum, Bitcoin, Binance coin. Let's jump over here and uh, take a quick peek. Transforming health together. This is a blockchain-powered clinical trial management. Most of us know what clinical trials are. CTI will significantly lower the cost of new medicines while also increasing their speed of delivery to market for the people that need them through a revolutionary, revolutionizing of the clinical trials process with the application of data Analytics, artificial intelligence, of course, we know that is AI, machine learning, and more. There's a 20% bonus uh, coming in at this level. Uh, you guys can jump in and uh, very, very detailed. Oh, man, we've got some research here all over the board. Look at this when you get time. We obviously will not uh, spend that much time, 14, 16 minutes, as is what we generally do. First thing I want to do, I want to jump in, look at a quick one-minute video. And then we'll jump back. I actually want to look over these selling points, but let's, let's do the uh, the video real quick. A little over a minute long. Let's go. Every year, over 50 million people die because there is no medication for them. That's 100 lives per minute. Nine of the top 10 causes of death are related to disease where medicine is not effective or not delivered on time. How many more lives do we have to lose before proper medication is created? Medicines do not reach the people that need it on time, and when they do, they are often too expensive. It takes at least 10 years for a new medicine to be available to patients. Let's stop this now. Time equals lost lives and suffering. The Clintex Clinical Trials Intelligence CTI platform will transform healthcare. Medicines will reach those who need it when they need it. Cost of medicines will be reduced because of faster and more efficient clinical trials. Clintex CTI, the pharmaceutical blockchain solution. New medications, faster, cheaper, safer. Stop the suffering and let's transform health together. Faster, cheaper, safer. I like that. Brought to you, of course, uh, compliments of blockchain technology. All right, let's go over the selling points real quick. Clintex providing the first ever collaboration platform for clinical trials, exploiting the immutability. I love that word, unchangeable. You can't change it. Immutability and interoperability of distributed ledger technology, of course they're talking on the blockchain, to create an ecosystem to, father, to foster collaboration across entire pharmaceutical industry, which of course is massive. We all know how big uh, pharmaceutical industry is. This will be achieved through the creation of a perpetually increasing library of data analytics, facilitating the sharing of lessons learned across corporate boundaries without any compromise of sensitive data. They will bring machine learning to clinical trial management, all the while eliminating the need for hardware costs to be borne by the client. They'll introduce an attractive pay-per-use model for clients and applying powerful, insightful data analytic functionality across administrative, operational, and clinical functions in clinical trials. 
They will also allow for workflow management, closing the loop, and full audit trail. Full trail, love that. Functionality, functionality to identify action, resolve issues, detect it by the tool. We'll go over some more of this a little later on. Uh, 14 team members, five advisors. Uh, if you've listened to more than a few of our videos, you know that we like a substantial team. Uh, and they do have a good sized team uh, going through all their files, their LinkedIn rather, uh, and, and social media accounts. And we'll get into that shortly. I don't want to get ahead of the game. Telegram, 3,756 followers in Telegram. That's substantial. Twitter, 620. The market size, folks, is massive. Clinical trials, huge, huge. Future market trial, uh, is it's virtually unlimited. How far back do the footsteps go? Well, according to their uh, footstep chart, QT of 2018, which that doesn't help us much, that's where we're at right now. I do wish these companies would go further back uh, without having to dig too far for somebody doing research to see how far back they actually go. You've heard me say this before. You don't wake up one morning and say, hey, let's do an ICO for clinical trials. Matter of fact, let's do it this evening. And they talk about it over breakfast. No, with something of this magnitude, this level of professionalism goes back a very long time, sometimes two and three years. I'm working on one uh, now that we're going to be bringing to you that goes back a decade or longer. So, you know, the far back as the uh, footsteps that I can see, QT doesn't help us much, but uh, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm sure it goes back much, much further than that. One of the boxes that I have checked here on all of the evaluations that I do, the overall opinion of the company and the vision, very, very impressed. Uh, let's jump on over here to the, uh, let's see, this is called, this is the light paper. I like that, white paper and a light paper. We'll look at the white paper shortly, but let's get as much information off of the light paper as we can. Syntex, their solution provider to the pharmaceutical industry. Predictive and a little bit having a hard time with that word. Predictive analytics, machine learning. They're going to be the first in the industry to do this. They'll deliver predictive analytics and machine learning. CTI, clinical trials intelligence platforms, revolutionize how clinical trials are conducted. The whole while saving you time and money. Um, let's look at the real world problems. This is what I like. This is what it's called the problems and the solutions. Actually, I have a better place for that. Let's go on over to uh, Bitcoin or BitTalk.org. Matter of fact, if you go to BitTalk.org, you'll see all of the tools that we are highlighting today. Uh, they've got them laid out. Uh, white paper, light paper, company website, all of this is right here. So the problems and the solutions, let's go with the problems. Clinical trials are inefficient in their use of funding and resources with resulting costs spiraling. $1.3 billion new medicine driving up the cost of said medicine. Very expensive. The volume, annual number of registered clinical trials has increased from 3,294 in 2004 to 23,384, of course, along the way, escalating cost, delays in new medicine. These guys do an excellent job of highlighting the problem and the solution. I won't even do an ICO review if somebody can't give me a problem that your coin solves. And if you can't identify the problem, then I don't even want to talk to you about the solution. These guys have done a great job lining that out. Reactive, currently, operational, clinical inefficiencies are identified after they occur, not before. And we know what that does. It brings up the cost substantially. Lack of predictive insight, greater cost, and more delays. Patients, difficulty in patient recruitment, retention results in 80% of all clinical trials being delayed by an average of almost a year, 10.8 months. Data quality, implausible, incomplete data. Again, that's a way to have clinical trials fail and to drive cost of medicine that you and I uh, pay for. Uh, every failed clinical trial is a jack up on the cost of the medicine. You're going to pay a little more for it. Admin, identification and payments to doctors 
and other third-party vendors can delay clinical trial in initiation and timely progression. Of course, you know when there's a delay, there's a cost. Look at there on the bottom. I didn't even see this. $8 million lost revenue for each day a clinical trial is delayed. What's the solution? Operational excellence. Clinical data visualizations, predictive analysis. Folks, if you can predict it ahead of time, what you think is going to happen, the prognosis and the end result of what does happen, you can identify it early on, and a clinical trial doesn't nearly cost you uh, nearly as much. So this is, uh, this is the team here. I don't think these LinkedIn's are hot. They're not. So let's get to that in the white paper. Uh, we'll cover the team on the white paper and this is it okay good <clears throat> excuse me new medicine faster cheaper safer i like that here's a disclaimer we won't go through the clinical jargon let's just scroll down till we see the team anything catches our uh view prior to hitting that we'll look at it this this is uh four phases that they're going into you guys can look at this when you get a chance uh, here's some charts and analysis, cost of trials, target market. This is a huge, huge target. Great project. I, I'm really impressed with this one. The only thing I did not like is what I mentioned earlier. Competitive analysis, uh, great competitive analysis. Read this when time permits. Uh, great opportunity here. Here's their approach at going things. Basically just a little bit different. I'm always a fan of the blockchain. We know this whole world is going blockchain. Our blockchain-powered clinical trial analytical tools unlock the true value of interoperability, significantly reducing the current cost of intermediate intermediaries. Enterprise blockchain solution, initiate design strengthen implementation. Why blockchain? I don't have time to get into that, but this is certainly worth your attention. Reading over it, let's get down to the team is the main thing I want to find on here. Uh, because it was hyperlinked. I always like to show you. Here's the uh, unique selling points. I always like to show you uh, the team, and the fact is they are who they say they are by most of the time LinkedIn, social media. Let's just jump down here pretty quick here. We're getting into some charts. Okay, now I did, I did show you the team on that uh, shorter page, but I, I specifically wanted it here. here here's the, uh, the roadmap, Q2. Again, you know it goes back much further than that goes all the way up to Q4 2020. Uh, so these guys are moving forward. Why Ethereum? You can read that when you get a chance. Smart contracts. Man, you have no idea. I'm a fan of smart contracts. Why if you do an ERC20 um, Ethereum based with a smart contract, that means it's immutable, folks. Once it's set in motion, it can't be changed. I hate to sound like a broken record, but I love that. Uh, because you get something somewhat perfect, you don't want somebody coming in and, and changing it. All right, I'm doing what I don't like people to do, and let's just read over the white pages. Here we go. Here's what I want to see. Okay, uh, LinkedIn links are hot. They're there. These people who are, are who they say. By the way, I forgot to mention uh, they are coming out of the UK. 116 connections. Neil Barron and it's got Clintex. I always like their LinkedIn. Uh, to have the project name on it, please don't tell me we got to do this again. I cannot believe this. Okay, well, we're not going to go through very many LinkedIn files for sure. Uh, that's one thing I don't like. I'm a big fan of hyperlinking, but this is ridiculous. have to scroll through this in. Folks, you don't, talk, you don't hear me talk negative too much, and I'm not really talking negative now. It's just a pet peeve of mine, okay? All right, let's go back to the team. I uh, clicked on quite a few of these. All of them came up well-rounded. Uh, I mean, look at the um, bios of these each individuals. These guys are well able to do what they say they're going to do. Plenty of advisors. I like that. Uh, here's the Bitcoin, or keep saying Bitcoin. Bit, it is Bitcoin. Bitcointalk.org. Go here. Uh, these, these are not hyperlinked here, uh, but they've got a lot of information. Chock full. This is a project I do recommend you look at, as always, on the uh, Bitcoin Exchange channel. I want to tell you, do your diligence. Don't just do it because we decided to do an ICO review. Uh, a few of the projects that uh, approach us about doing reviews that we actually take on. So by the time you hear it coming from this microphone, if uh, if we have done a, an ICO review, that means they have crossed 
in our, our vetting process, uh, and a lot of these are vetted uh, before we get them. So we do a double vetting process. Uh, always, always, always do your research. Again, Clin Tech's call letter is, find my other page that I put on the ground, on the floor earlier, CLX, Clin Tech's Clinical Trial, Pharmaceutical Industry, great project, take a look at it. Folks, do your diligence, do me a favor, Hit the red subscribe button. Uh, we like you to subscribe to our channel. We try to bring these things periodically. I've got a couple more I'm going to be doing behind this one. Uh, my co-host Jay joins me in some of these. Thank you for subscribing. We appreciate you being a viewer. And as always, we will see you in the future.